The St. Kieran, who established Clement Noyes uh, back in, in the uh, 6th century, is believed to be buried over here in Clement in uh, his a very, very small uh, church. And because of that, it was deemed to be very holy ground. And uh, for the, the kings of Ireland, status and death was as important as status in life. And uh, it, it was a great honour to be buried here at Clement Noyes. And to get that privilege, uh, they would have funded the building of the churches. There were up to 14 churches here at the height of, uh, of, of Clement Noyes. Um, so uh, Clement Noyes uh, was afforded the protection and, and, and funding of the kings of Ireland. And indeed, the last High King of Ireland, Rory O'Connor, is believed to be, to be buried here. But as you can see today, um, all that remains are the remnants of those churches and we don't see the wider um, uh, city and the people that, that surround it and, and live their, their daily lives. So Clement Noyes really is a lost city. But uh, because uh, of modern technology, uh, 3D graph design, uh, GPS and, and, and now the, the mobile GP, uh, GPS supported by tablets and smartphones, we can now develop an app that essentially allows you to travel back in time and to view the lost city of Clamont Noyes um, uh, through the app. So it provides a window into the past.